you're welcome this video section is basically on how you can edit your images to fit into a particular description whatsoever that the platform for instance investor for budget sponsor may give you some may tell you that it has to be in png format some may tell you it has to be in jpeg format some may tell you that it has to be in gif format and all that some can also give you description as to the size so this video will quickly go through this video will guide you how you can do it yourself with minimal knowledge of computer with minimal computer knowledge first and foremost you must have the image of the device for instance i have mine here so let's assume that i intend to edit this to a particular format for instance i need to use jpeg and i want to convert this to jpeg in case assuming that it is not in jpeg so i need the end this image in the jpeg format just come to the image and right click on it please this is applicable only to a window system window system so you right click on it and come to edit so that takes you to a page where you could edit the image so obviously my image is very large you can see from the screen it is 9.2 megabytes and 4000 by 600 pixels i need a bit lesser than that and my my target is actually to have an image of jpeg formats so in that in that way, so my 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 target is to have an image of JPEG format. So to do that, I simply come to the file here and click save as. That gives you different formats. You see, the first one is J is PNG, the second one is JPEG, the third one BMP and all that. So if the site where I'm uploading my picture, so my passport to says. MB, I mean BMP, I think it's like this and, and save it. If it says PNG, I will do it the same way, but I need JPEG. I will do a click on it, then I will save it. JPEG. JPG. Let's say JPG passwords. Straight away, I have a JPEG format passport. So you can see. This is my JPEG format. So if I upload this on the very website of Dr. Way, I'm instructed to upload only JPEG. This is very really good. Now I want to quickly touch. So I want to quickly go through where you can also reduce the size. Now reducing the size, click on the image again, click on the image again, and right click and right click on the image again. Then you reduce the size from here. You can see the size. Reduce the size from here. Let's also pay attention to this very column where we have the pixel one and look at the size there having saved it in jpeg it has reduced the file size to 5.5 but i need a little i need i need a, an image that is less than 100 kilobytes obviously i think i believe that you know that 1000 megabytes i mean 1000 kilobytes makes one megabyte so if i'm having 5.5 megabytes in kilobyte that is 5500 kilobytes and the quarter for instance in this video quarter states that you shouldn't upload more than 100 kilobytes so i have to reduce this size in order to do that i simply come here and do it and click on the size here i can put 10 and see how that comes out then save it Please note this size and see the change that will have happened. You can see it has been reduced to 80 kilobytes from 5.5. But quite fine. The size is okay, but I do not need this image to be this because I actually need the passport. I do not need this image to be this extended so I can reduce it. Bring your cursor to the tail point here and drag it off. And that gives me passport life. At least we still can use this passport life uh, picture. 
So if I need to edit this side as well, I simply click on edit, then edit this way, then drag it this way, then rotate again, then I have my passport. Now you look at the size, the size has drastically reduced to 47.5 million, which the investor portal will accept. And you could click click four by zero zero, which the portal will do as well. And let me also point this out in a situation where your own credentials, for instance, go level, first degree, or whatever image is, is, is that you scan, is okay, let me also point this out in a situation where you have your own level, your first degree, your second degree, or any certificate or whatsoever that you are putting to the portal. You must. Let me also point this out. In the situation where you have more than one page of a certificate, or more than one page, say for instance a transcript, and you're trying to upload, you know you can only upload an image per description. What I mean by this is this: when you do it, when you select transcript, you can only upload one item for each transcript. What that implies is that you must reduce the size of all the pages and make all other pages to make one page of image. So, for instance, if your transcript has seven pages, scan them to image and make all the seven pages of the images, merge them to make one. Thank you.